I, I got involved with 3D ME uh, because patients of mine were related to the people who run the company. And, and they actually got me involved to do a, pro a couple of projects whereby uh, animations were performed from operations which I get done, which I got done, which, uh, which then went on to presentations at, at meetings. And it was a learning experience at that stage for both the company and for myself um, be, uh, in, in pursuing this. And that was, that, was, that was a fascinating experience because you're, you're on the road of discovery in doing that. These animations are, can be an amazing teaching tool. The only time I'd seen animations previously were produced by multinational companies and they're fairly generic, they don't make it very lifelike really. In what was done with this, it, because it was based on, a, um, on human anatomy in a more real manner, um, where portions of the surroundings were slowly taken aback to the core, um, it actually gave really good teaching videos of, of the operations which, which we were showing. I think, th I think this sort of stuff has a real part to play at a surgeon level, at what I'm doing. Um, more particularly, if it can be ramped up, um, I think it, it also would have a huge place uh, anatomically to, as an educational tool um, at medical schools. And that's where I see a huge plus for the future. Um, is to produce that hopefully relate to medical schools and do it at a base level um, so that people can understand anatomy and maybe maybe even at a training level for trainees at surgery that it would take them through uh, structures to help with learning operations so not at a, not even at a surgeon level where we need less to actually allow us to, to, to learn processes, but at a more base level. And that's certainly the level where this, the, the animations come from, is an understanding of anatomy, where each layer down can be taken away to see, to show you the, the next layer underneath, so you can go structurally through the body. I think it has a potentially huge future. The limitations, well, there's only one limitation, and that's money because to actually make it superb and keep evolving it to its ultimate is just is going to be a financial burden beyond that the sky's the limit